Hey, what's up, everybody? If you're ready to transform, I want to give me a hey, give me a yo, give me a whoop, give me a clapping emoji, give me a muscle emoji, give me something to let me know that you are here and ready to go. Oh, 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 yes, Kathy. Yes, Lisa, Jessica, Daphne, Monica, Dara, Monica, Kristen, Brittany, Dominique, Nicole, and Ashley, Katie, Kristen, Bree, Sydney. All right, all right, all right, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. No, I'm so excited that you are all here and ready to go. My name is Sean T. Been with Beachbody for 13 years, just in case you don't know me. Um, and I'm so excited to be celebrating 20 years of Beachbody coming up in 2019. Um, if you want to know more information about me, you can just go to my website or you can go to my Instagram. But more importantly, just know that I'm your biggest fan along the way. And I know a lot of people out there may have not done my fitness programs just as of yet because I heard people are afraid and I don't know why because I'm really there to motivate you. Push yourself all the way through. But you don't want to hear about me. You want to hear about Transform 20. Right? I know you do. Anyway, I'm so excited to tell you about it. So here we go. I want you to grab a pencil or a pen and get ready because this call is going to be filled with everything you need to know Transform 20. And then at the end, I'm giving you time to answer questions. We're going to do a rapid fire question and answer. So as you go through, write your questions down. So when I say, are you ready for questions? You type them up. And I got my lovely man, Sam, over here. What up? Who's going to be... Tune it in. All right, and help me out. Here we go, Transform 20. It's a six week program. Somebody say, hey Sam, you probably saw that. It's a six week program. Every workout in the base kit is 20 minutes. There's no workout that's longer than 20 minutes. It's six days a week. Um, it's designed in three chapters. Chapter one is commit, chapter two is climb, chapter three is conquer. Chapter one, commit. The reason why I call it chapter one commit in this program, or this is what makes the program different, is because most people quit within the first week to two weeks of a fitness program and they find excuses well excuses are tools of incompetence and let me tell you something commitment in this program is going to be delivered to you every single day while you're working out and we're working the muscles and we're working the abs and we're working the legs and i'm telling you what muscle group you're working i'm also going to be telling you why you should stay committed to push yourself through and why commitment is the thing that's going to make you have sustainable results chapter two we get to climb. Climb, the, the workouts get a little tougher, but you'll be more acquainted with the step. You'll be in the zone of releasing that inner strength because in order to climb, you have to use your core just a little bit more. You have to use your legs a little bit more. And more importantly, the umbrella of what you're using is your strength, inner strength, being able to push yourself, releasing the soundtrack of your mind. Chapter three is conquer. While most people think like, oh, conquer, like I'm gonna be finished the workout, no. Conquer in this program is about you finding sustainability so that you don't yo-yo because the yo-yo is a child's game. You're not a child, and so and neither is your weight. So we're going to push through so that all of you know that you can have sustainable results and that the after photo is a snapshot in time and a progress photo is a snapshot of your sustainability. So here we go. Now, you got six workouts, six workouts per week. You got burn Mondays. Burn workout is about burning the calories. It's about inviting the burn to your, your body because most people out there, when they feel a burn for the first time, they're like, oh my gosh, this hurts. And then they want to quit. But let me tell you something. We're going to change the narrative. We're going to say when the burn comes, bring it even more. Not like, oh my gosh, this hurts. This is like, yes. Like, that's all you got for me, body? That's all you got for me? That's all you got for me, leg? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Bring the burn just a little bit more. You know, when we come off the weekend, you know, you may have eaten something that you didn't want to eat, even though I don't deprive myself of the fun things that I want to eat. I just have portion control. And so Monday is about burning, burning the negativity, burning the, burning the calories, and bringing in the burn now and inviting the burn to your body. Day two, because most of the time as the week goes forward, people regress in motivation. And so day two is faster Tuesdays. And that means we increase the momentum on Tuesdays. It's an agility workout. It's going to push. It's designed to give you high calorie burn. Not only will you get high calorie burn, but I'm going to teach you how to break the cadence, meaning that most of the time when we work out, we find a cadence that we like, but I'm going to remind you that you need to break the cadence. You don't have to go as fast as me or the person over there, the person over there, but what is your cadence and how 
can you push through it and push past it? Day three is stronger. We slow things down. This step is designed for you to get even more tone because when you're doing push-ups, you go greater range of motion. When you're doing dips, when you're doing lunges, when you're doing squats, it's designed that anything that's on that step, your hand or your leg, it's designed to help that muscle push a little bit more. Day four is powerful Thursdays. I hope you're writing this stuff down. Powerful Thursdays is plyometric training, but that helps you release your power. There are no tuck jumps. There are no power jumps. There are no diamond jumps. But what it is, yes, it's called. You're recording the call, right? Yes, the call is being recorded. Don't worry about it. I got your back. Now, uh, there are no tuck jumps, no diamond jumps, no uh, power jumps. But what it is, when you do jump, when you do elevate yourself, what you need to do is have, have greater air time. And I'm not talking about how high you jump. I'm like, don't jump and be like, oh my gosh, I can't do this. Jump and open up the chest, release the power. Just know that every time you come off the ground, you're exuding some kind of power that maybe you didn't think you had before. And maybe you didn't think you could go one more and you did. So open up the airway so that the, the, and open up the motivation so that the power can be released because nothing can be released in a closed space. Now, that's going to work your legs, your back, your chest, your shoulders. It's going to be amazing for you. Fridays is cut Fridays. Where we change the range of motion. We release the range of motion from going up and down to little pulses and holds so that you can literally, you know, cut your body up by using mostly your body weight because I have some bonus workouts for you that I want to talk about. On Saturdays, this is the most important workout is balanced Saturdays. Most people will look at it as a... Uh, most people will, will look at it as a stretch workout, and it's not. It's because you still have your transformers, which I'll talk about in a second. This workout is designed to make you pulse so that you, I mean, this workout is designed to make you to stretch and, but more importantly, to recalibrate your life so that on Saturdays, you're not finishing the week with like, oh, I'm going so hard. You're finishing the week with being like, you know what? I'm coming back to me, and I'm finding me again, and I'm going to celebrate everything that I did this week, and now I'm going to push forward. Sundays mandatory is Transform Your Life with Sean T, the reality show where we take you behind the scenes. You know, in the old school real world, real world, the slogan was find out what happens when people stop being polite and start getting real. Where here's find out what happens off the set when we're not, you know, sometimes smiling and having a good time. What are people really going through? And that you can maybe connect to something or a story or something about somebody's story that's going to help you transform your life. In addition, all of you will be running coach test groups, hopefully, or coach challenge groups during this program. And all of your coach challenge groups will be in my exclusive coach test group on January 14th. Anyway, we'll get back to that in a second. But while you're running your challenge groups on Sunday, what you're going to do is go live after your entire challenge groups watches transform your life with Sean T and you go live and open up the conversation because a lot of people don't commit because they don't have anyone to talk to and they can't release that one thing that's been holding you back. So can you push away the things and the people that told you it can't be done and decide for yourself what you can achieve by not holding it back? So treat it like a book club and open up the conversation so that you are the leader of your group and you're literally coaching people through this in all different areas of this transformation. Let's talk about transformers. There are transformers, there are three transformers in every single workout. That's right. Every single workout, in addition to the actual workout, you're going to be challenged. You'll know transformers coming up because you're going to hear some hear me say it's time for recovery tasks. While you're doing a recovery task, I'm going to be showing you the exercise. The exercise you do for that one minute and you have to count the reps. That means you have to stay connected and committed to your workout. You're going to be counting the reps. Now, when that one minute is over of your transformer, you're gonna write your reps down on this lovely dry erase wall calendar. Now, you'll see Dave Byrne has three transformers. So every week you're gonna do your transformers for Byrne and you're gonna see those numbers increase. Then on Tuesdays, you have three different transformers for every single workout. Now, while you're doing your workout, you have to write your number down and get right back into it. It's 20 minutes, there's no breaks. So just back to the dry race. So once you finish your first round, you take a photo of it, you get all your numbers. So when you do it as a second round, you can hit the game. All right, next up, you have your get started guide, okay? I'm not gonna tell you what's in here because this is fun. And when you get started, you'll see. Now, the reason why I created 
uh, transformers is because I was sick of people going to the scale in the morning for the scale and another machine to dictate what your move was going to be like that day. When you look at, I, I say, do your workout and actually do your transformers before you actually go to the scale. So you create a number, right? No longer will you look at a machine to create your number and your mood. You're going to create the number with the machine, which is your body. So make sure you do your transformers before you weigh yourself every day. The next thing that's really important is, yes, create the number yourself. The next thing is your nutrition guide. This has recipes. This has pretty much everything you need in terms of what you're going to eat. But more importantly, yes, food, nail me. But more importantly, before we talk about food, what I want to talk about is what nutrition plan will you do with this program? If 2B Mindset has worked for you, then you do 2B Mindset. Alana's amazing. Live your best life with her. If you've been doing portion fix or using a portion containers with Autumn, do the portion. If it's worked for you, do it. If you're an 85, 15 person like me, where I know what I need to eat to feel and look the way that I want to look, but I can also have a donut or two, or maybe not two, or maybe one and a half. But I don't deprive myself, right? But we're all on different levels of our transformation and, and our relationship with food. So when it comes to food, do what has been working for you. And I promise with the mental motivation that I'm going to give you in, in addition to the fitness movement in this workout, you will see results and you will succeed. Now, one of my favorite parts about, about the entire program and all the collateral that you're going to get when you get your packs and all your coaches and customers get their packs is the transformation tracker i'm just going to say this if you fill out everything in this tracker every single day you'll be able to write three chapters in your book so as i go through this i want you to think of what is the first line of my book going to be now here you go you're basically going to start with a contract to yourself you're going to say obviously your name your date your physical emotional professional and personal goal and then you're going to put your signature at the bottom now when you buy a house or buy a car and you sign that, your name at the bottom, what do you do? You start making payments, right? Well, in this transformation tracker, you make payments every single day. You're gonna put the date, you're gonna put your workout, you're gonna put your transformers first, and then you're gonna weigh yourself. You're gonna put your bonus workout, then you're gonna put how do you feel, what you ate, breakfast, lunch, dinner, your snacks. Then you're gonna have your portion tally. Then you're gonna have your Shakeology. Did you drink it? Did you not? Your ingredients? Because imagine if you actually put the ingredients in there, then maybe you can have some different um, Shakeology recipes. Your beach body performance, your water, your coffee, your, or your tea. Did you laugh today a lot, a little, or will you laugh a little bit more tomorrow? Then how much sleep did you have? Because as you know, sleep is one of the most important things to get in your results. Then my favorite part, your challenges and how you overcame them. And then at the bottom, your show informations. They're like the truth bombs in my book. Here we go, y'all. If you actually pay your dues and you actually put, put money into the bank every single day, you will be able to write three chapters of your book. They don't have to be long chapters. They just have to be chapters. So I ask you again, what is the title page of your book going to be? And what is the final phrase of chapter three going to be? to where you are and how you're gonna push yourself to sustain your results. There's gonna be a lot that happens during this process. And what you need to know is that you are definitely gonna transform your life. This word cloud is actually on the uh, set. So you can always look up and see some motivation that myself, my team and the cast has um, put together for you so that you stay motivated all the way through. Also, if you stay committed, the first two weeks, if you finish the first two weeks, you can put your commit sticker on your step. Second two weeks, you can put your climb sticker. Third two weeks, you can put your conquer sticker. Six weeks. Now, let's talk about the bonus work. Oh, and when you put your stickers on your step, don't just flop them on the step. I want you to think about why you're putting that sticker on your step in something that you've actually done within that last two weeks of that chapter that was a motivating and inspirational way. And think about that as you place that sticker down. Now let's talk about bonus workouts. You have three bonus workouts. So you have three 10 minute bonus workouts. You have a, you have a cardio workout, you have a, a best butt workout, and you have a 10 minute um, ab workout. 
you have a 15 minute ab workout, you have a 20 minute ab workout. You also have six weight training workouts where you use dumbbells. So if you're a person that's like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna miss dumbbells, miss no further. You have two dumbbell workouts per week that you can put in place of stronger and cut Fridays or, or cut, or you can add it in addition to it if you're crazy enough to wanna to do 20 minutes of workout. Now, 40 minutes of working out. Now, you also have on December 4th, when you buy your packs, right, you're going to get your step. And then on December 11th, transform uh, uh, the Fit for Marshall is released on Beach Body on Demand in front of the paywall. So anybody can do that workout. It's me basically explaining what the workout is and what it's about. Behind the paywall, you're going to get Transform in 10, which is a 10 minute trans Transform 20 workout and a transform in 15. These are prep workouts to prep you and everybody ready. Now, on December 4th, when you get access to get behind the paywall and your customers, there's gonna be some videos in there that I explain what the program's about, the modifier, because there's a modifier in this program, there's gonna be a split screen modifier, there's gonna be Olivia in the workout who doesn't have the step. So there's three different layers. There's me who's on the step the entire time, there's Olivia in the workouts that has our step, and then you have a split screen modifier where I'll still be on the screen, but you can modify as well so that you can continue to push no matter what fitness level you are. Also, on December 4th, with, when you see the stuff about the modification, the program, like all of the fun stuff, start your challenge groups early, even though the workouts won't be released until the 14th of January, because what you want to do is each give them lessons every day or, or a couple times so that they know the program just as well as you know it and they can have fun now later today on my instagram stories i'm going to upload a hybrid calendar for people who want a hybrid calendar to um a hybrid calendar to prep for transform 20. so i'll have a link where you can um download the calendar for that so december 4th packs go on sale december 11th all of the prep workouts become available on trans for um on beach body on demand I think that's it besides my coach group. My coach group, um, so anyone who actually becomes a coach and they get a pack, they'll get an email that can send them into the coach, uh, my coach test group, exclusive test group right away. And even though the, the group doesn't open until January 7th and we're not, that's the prep week and then on the 14th, we start the entire journey together, you can still, join so make sure you get all of your challenge groups and all of your customers to become a coach and tell them shanti is going to be guiding us every step of the way it's going to be a very positive experience and you're going to get motivation every single day we have question and answers we'll give you everything you need and you're also going to get some coach training in this particular coach exclusive test group for me all right now it's time for questions i'm gonna ask answer a couple first what time is it Okay, cool. I'm going to answer a couple questions first. How is Transform 20 different? Transform 20 is different because I'm taking your mental, I'm, like, I, I care about your body, but I'm more interested in what's happening in your life and in your mind. And so I'm giving you the freedom to have your voice heard so that you can have sustainable results by releasing the baggage that could possibly be on your shoulders. Um, the other thing that makes this program different is obviously the step. Beachbody doesn't have any step in their repertoire except for me. Well, they have, you do have a step when you do um, Les Mills Pump and probably some other workouts, but this entire workout is designed for the step. So that's really fun. And the other thing is just being able to track your progress and doing it in chapters and really having you commit to, you know, writing your own story. Um, and the workouts and the movements are fun. All right, ready? Questions, go. Uh, will any step work? I have one from 15 years ago. I just, just want to make sure it will work with your program. Well, if you have another step, like I have back there in the corner, I call it the dinosaur step. And there are two people in the workouts using that. You just have to follow them so that you can keep up. You know, 15 years, ain't not wrong, 15 years, but I'm gonna tell you right now, you want that beach body step if there's any after the four. Go ahead. Uh, a couple of you asked if you could explain the bonus workouts again. Okay, so the bonus workouts, make sure you have your 10. Bonus workouts, there are three 10-minute bonus workouts. There's a 10-minute cardio, there's a 10-minute butt workout, and there's a 10-minute ab workout. There's also a 15-minute ab workout, and there's a 20-minute ab workout. 
There's also two prep workouts under 20 minutes. There's a transforming 10, which is a 10 minute workout. There's a transforming 15. There's also the fit commercial, which is a 20 minute full transform 20 workout that is in front of the paywall on beach body on demand. And there are six bonus weight training workouts. There are rip and cut and there's built stronger that can replace or go in addition to your stronger Wednesdays and your cut Fridays. And no workout is over 20 minutes. Is this safe for a pregnant woman? So is this safe for a pregnant woman? We've had people in the test group that are pregnant. Uh, they just did it slowly, but at the end of the day, it's about you going to your physician and your doctor and saying, hey, can I do this? And it's also, it also comes down to what you've been doing before you were pregnant. So just uh, show your, your doctor a couple of movements that you're doing. But with the modifications, I think you might be okay. But, you know, check. Every, every woman's pregnant body is different. So make sure you check with your physician. Um, is it like max 30 in terms of intensity? Is it like max 30 in terms of intensity? It's just different. Um, you burn the same amount of calories in the 20 minutes that you would in max 30. But there are some workouts where you're not even jumping and you feel like, are you kidding me? Because just that little elevation is pushing you to the next level. So yeah, insanity, insanity, max 30. But don't let the, don't let the intensity guide you because it's such, it's such a dynamic workout and you're gonna see between week one and week three how much faster you move how much more confident you feel so you know it's not all on the floor you have you know your friend to step there helping you along the way do you recommend doing more than one round or will we risk plateauing then you just hear me say that this plateau now this plat this is a plateau this plateau is going to help you build say you do one round you get a lot of results and then the second round you're like okay i'm gonna add weights and i'm gonna add an additional weight workout like two days a week, or I'm gonna add some bonuses, right? You can't, you won't plateau unless it's time for you to plateau, which means your body is at its peak state, right? So don't look at plateauing as a bad thing. Just recalibrate and switch some things around and get creative because I know you can always enhance. Always, always, always. All right, last question. Does this, pro does this workout program focus on reps or time? All right, last question. Uh, this pro this program focuses on time. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's about time, um, but it's not about rushing through the time. It's about literally taking your time and making every second count. So I like time workouts because it's about freedom, and you don't have to keep up with me. You just keep up with yourself. Um, that's just my personal when I'm doing home fitness. Um, I've done time workouts, you know, with Asylum and stuff like that, and I realized that. Um, while there are even some times where maybe I'm feeling like I'm moving slow and it's still too fast for other people. So um, I make sure you are in time. I mean, I give you time, uh, but there are some workouts where we stay together. So you'll get a kind of a mixture of both. Good. All right, I'm so excited. I hope you are all excited. We are gonna push this. It's gonna be so incredibly exciting. And more importantly, just, you know, conquer your mind so you can transform your life. And I really appreciate you all being on here today. I didn't do the does this work for you. Did, and this one did. Oh, before you go, before you go, don't hang up. Don't hang up. Don't hang up. You're going to have a lot of people out there talking about, does this program work? Does this program work? Oh, my God, is it going to work? And this is what you're going to say. Are you going to do the work? Oh, okay. So, and maybe you've been one of people, is this program going to work? If you do the work and you give it all you got, you can tell them it's absolutely going to work. But when you do, when someone does ask you that question, your pause needs to be that long. You need to, you need to either FaceTime them or look at them like, are you going to do the work? and make them uncomfortable as hell because they only got one question. All right.
Thank you all for coming on. Boom. Let's shake the room. I'll talk to you guys sooner than later. And also join my live. I'm doing a live when on December 4th when Transform 20 comes out. I think it goes on sale at 12 p.m. Pacific time, 3 a.m. Eastern time, 1 a.m. here in Arizona. So I'm going to be live on my Instagram page. So get up and do a little, you know, maybe 10 minute workout with me to celebrate. I know it's going to be early in the morning, but hey, why not do something fun and have fun? Peace out. Thank you. Thank you.